What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode. And today, guys, we're out here at the shop. I was able to make it out here. As you, y'all can see, look at that. The weather is coming in. We got some bad weather uh, for the next couple of days. And we've been having bad weather for the last couple of days. But um, I wanted to come out here, guys, and uh, and uh, I wanted to start doing something to the extended cab. And um, I know y- y'all probably seen it on a couple of trucks. And since, you know, I'm a, a budget builder, I could, y'all can say, um, I wanted to go ahead and show y'all what I'm talking about. Um, man, this light. Hold on, let me get the lights, guys. So, the truck, guys, you know, it's not the prettiest, but, you know, is um, workable. So what I'm gonna try to do today, guys, is uh, clean the bin, the inside of the bin, and um, <laughs> and we're gonna paint it, guys. We're gonna paint the inside of the bin uh, red. And um, I know y'all gonna say, "Man, what are you doing, bro?" But like I told y'all, guys, uh, this. This truck is a, it's a Taquache build. Um, so, you know, that's a, the easiest way I can say it. And hopefully I like it. I think it's gonna turn out pretty good. Uh, I'm gonna sand it down uh, just a little bit. Not, I'm not gonna, you know, perfect it or nothing. Uh, so the pink catch. I know the bottom of the bed is real, real, uh, scuffed up but let me show y'all let me show y'all what I'm talking about all right guys so this is what the bed looks like now um, I was painting some stuff on on the bed last week so that's where I got the idea from and I have seen it in a couple of trucks already but uh, the, the inside of the bed is pretty messed up already you know it has a lot of dings and dents you know the, I from what I know, you know, this truck used to be a work truck, but, um, you know, we're trying to bring it back to life, and that's what we're doing today, guys. Uh, I'm going to start sanding. I'm going to start with the tailgate. I'm going to start with the tailgate first, and we're going to go from there. Uh, hopefully, I can hear me right, guys. Um, like I said in my last video, I lost my, uh, my microphone, and, um, you know, I still haven't gotten another one. And hopefully y'all can hear me right. Um, we're gonna try to beat the weather because uh, I think it's starting to rain already. But we're gonna try to do at least a tailgate, at least sand it down and sand the, the sides. You know, I'm gonna do the sides first. Um, I do have a, a a sander, a palm sander, and but I only have a, a 400 grid, and 400 grid is really not gonna do nothing. You know, so I don't know. I'm gonna try to see what I could do by hand, and if anything, you know, I'll just see what the 400 grit does on the on the paint on the bed. But um, let's get started, guys, because this weather's rolling in, and I've been wanting to do this for a couple days already. But every single time that I try to start. The rain catches me, so man, let's see what we can do. All right, guys. So um, I ended up hitting the tailgate with uh, with the palm sander, and um, you know I got it pretty okay. It's all right, it's not the best, but it's gonna stay like that. And we're gonna go ahead and paint the tailgate uh, just to see uh, you know a little progress since the rain's coming in already. Uh, hopefully, I enjoy. So I found this pen, guys, uh, at the dollar store for a dollar, and I got a couple pens. It's red, so it's good enough. Uh, I don't know, it's starting to rain, so...
So, um, I don't know what happened, guys. I thought I was recording, but it wasn't recording. But it was, but it wasn't. I don't know. And, um, you know, this is the second code I gave it. You know, it still needs a little bit more. But um, she's real glossy. And I don't really like it. But um, I'm going to go ahead and still finish it. And then maybe we can wet sand it a little bit and, you know, take the gloss off. Or maybe, you know, once it fully dries, it'll look um, a lot better. But um, I'm going to keep on um, painting. Probably give it like two more coats. And hopefully this time uh, the phone don't mess up and uh, we can record this. Uh, it's raining already. But um, we're going to continue painting. day and um, yesterday the rain got here and we couldn't do much anymore so uh, I ended up going home but um, today guys we're gonna go to the car wash and uh, clean the bed 
because on the corners they have a lot of trash. Like, uh, I don't know, dirt. I don't know. I know the truck was sitting for a while, so maybe, you know, it's dirt from that. But um, I already sanded the sides uh, with the DA, with the palm sander. And um, we're going to go and watch that. I'm going to show you the tailgate. Let me know what that thing. So that's the tailgate, guys. She's real, real glossy. Um, I kind of don't like it. But um, we're going to go ahead and leave it like that for now. And um, hopefully, you know, we could uh, weight sand it a little bit and take the gloss off. But um, for right now, guys, we're, we're going to go to the car wash. And um, as y'all can see, I already got the bed, or oh, just really the sides sanded. I, I went ahead and used the 400 grid. Um, you know, that's what I had. And I cleaned this side off. So, you know, I know the paint's gonna stick. And plus, guys, uh, we're just trying to make the truck look a little bit better. I know I'm not doing this 100%, but, um, you know, it's going to help. Um, I also going to try to use the three-piece window, guys. We're going to custom make it fit, a custom fit um, on that. Because um, you know it was $120. I don't want I don't want that window to just be sitting there. So somehow, some way, we're gonna put it here. Some some way, some I don't know how guys we're gonna end up using it there. So we are back from the car wash. And she still needs a lot more sanding, guys, but it is what it is, and I'm going to go ahead and leave her like that, and I'm going to start painting the side walls. Uh, like I said, I'm not doing this 100%, since it's really the inside of a bed, and I'm not planning on putting nothing back there or really using it like that. So we're going to get started on the painting on the sides to see how it, how it goes. But, um, you know, it's scuffed down, you know pretty good on both sides the back to use a little bit more but um oh well guys so let's get started so i started with this side and working around my girl started on this side and she's working around. Uh, the bed still needs a lot of sanding, especially in that area right there. So I'm gonna wait on the bottom of the bed, but the side's coming out pretty good um, for like, what, I, about three cans so far. You know, that's three bucks. The sandpaper already had it. And you know, my time and labor, well, it's free, you know, I'm doing it myself. So for, I'm guessing around 10 bucks, guys, um, you could change up the look a little bit. And, you know, she's gonna look a lot better um, for the look that I'm going for. Um, I'm gonna add some decals later on, probably today, right here on the windshield, I mean the back glass. And um, go from there. Uh, but hopefully I uh, like this. If y'all do, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. But we're gonna continue to uh, paint. Uh, hopefully it could beat the weather again. Supposedly it's gonna rain real bad. But we're gonna get on it again, guys. I was gonna put you on the stand, but I can't find it. So I'ma just go ahead and do it like that. Y'all let me know what y'all think.
So what y'all guys think? Um, pretty much the sides are painted and the back is painted and this side is painted already guys okay uh, just missing the floor missing the floor but um I'm thinking maybe maybe going with a uh, black I'm still not sure yeah, guys, I'm still not sure. Um, thinking maybe with a black or go all the way red. But for now, we're gonna stop it right here, guys, because um, it's getting darker and darker, and it's already three, three o'clock in the afternoon. So I don't know. Maybe the rain's rolling in, and um, obviously I don't have a little shed. The trailblazer's in the way. I can't pull it all the way in. So um, I'm gonna end this video right here. And um, hopefully tomorrow I'm going to go ahead and finish it whatever color I decide to go with. Most likely it's going to be red. But uh, let me know what y'all think. Uh, I'm going to close the, the tailgate. So y'all can see it with the tailgate closed. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and end this video right here, guys. And um, if y'all like, you know what I did to the truck today, uh, give it a thumbs up. And uh, let me know what y'all think. Let me know, you know what else y'all want to see on the truck. But I want to give a shout out to my boy Irvin because he's the one that pretty much uh, started. You know painting things with a uh, rattle can and you know he did a, a couple of fenders and hoods and top of the I know I remember he did a uh, he had a single cab and he did a the roof on it it was bad and that hook came out real clean and you uh, and if it wasn't for him you know I probably would have never uh, known that you could do stuff like this with a spray can but um Y'all go ahead and like, subscribe this video, guys, and share it. And uh, we'll be back with some more content.